Hey guys, this is a review on the uh, Nerf Zombie Strike Sling Fire. So yeah, pause if you want to see the whole gun. So yeah, it's a lever act acting a rifle, or as some people call it, shotgun. Does it doesn't work like a shotgun? What you do to work the gun is you pull this and then pull it down and then shoot. So yeah. And then how you reload is you pull this all the way up, pull one of these these things, pull one of these things, and then get it out. What I thought before when I filled uh, the review on the unboxing, what I thought is you couldn't put it in when, but you you can put it in. You have when it's like that. You had to pull one of these things and then put it in. You don't. You, Slip it in and then pull it back. Start shooting. Um, there's a jam thing right there, so if there's a jam, you can easily fix it. So if there's a jam, you can easily easily fix it. So the pros and cons of this gun. The uh, con is start with the con. If you have it there, you can't pull it back because it's not the full way. You need to wait until you, until you hear. So it's kind of a uh, I, I got used. I got used to it, so yeah. So get stuck there, and you're like, "Why can't it pull down?" Just push it a bit more. And pull it down, and then you put it down. So yeah, that's. And then pros is it's comfortable on your hands, and it's easy to reload. You just do that. Reload. You can easily just do this and then grab another one, put it in, put that down, start shooting. You can fit any clip into here. So that's a pro. And it comes with a six clip, so that's a con. I wish it comes with 18 or something. So yeah. But it, but the gun looks cooler. This is a pro. The gun looks cooler with a six in it than any other, in my opinion. So yeah. Let's go on to the shooting test. Hey guys, I'm out for the shooting test. They're gonna be standing up and shooting, shooting them straight and then diagonal. So let's go. These are three straight shots. These are three diagonal. Let's go check the range. I'm going to be counting my steps and we'll see how far they shoot. The closest bolt was 19 feet. The second closest was 20. This one was 27. This one was 28. This one was 33 or 34. This one was 37. So the range is about average, I would say, uh, 32 feet. I would say the average. So yeah, hope you all enjoy this video. And yeah. See y'all next time. Wait. One sec. Let me grab my bullets. Okay, they almost dropped. Bye, Slap. Bye. Okay, I'm actually going to do a new thing for, for the, uh, the uh, Oh My Guns review. This gun, my opinion, I was kind of disappointed about the range. I thought it would shoot 60 at least. Like... I thought the farthest will be at least 60. It was 40. So, there's no wind. So, see? The wind would have blown it. It just rolled over there. So, yeah. Um, and I, overall, I was happy about it. It feels really comfortable. I thought it wouldn't feel as comfortable. And, thought the lever would be harder. 
pull forward and back. So I was quite happy about that. And I wish it came with a bigger clip, like I said earlier in this video. So now, anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please comment, like, subscribe. And I will see you one sec. I'll see you later. Bye. Okay, no, I'm, I'm actually kidding. Bye. One last thing is 35 bucks. So now, bye.